Welcome back. Welcome back to Full Circle with Mikali. A very good morning to you. How are you doing? Triple one, triple four, triple one. That is our SMS line, and it's just going to cost you a shilling to be part of the conversation. For you to send in your questions, uh, your opinions, your comments. And your answers to our giveaway question. The question is, how many books have you read so far this year? And you can list them down for us. So list them down and let us know how many books you've read so far. If there are more than three, three is the minimum. <laughs> three is the minimum. If you've read more, please just list them down and send that to our SMS line, triple one, triple four, triple one. Find us on social media as well. Switch TV KE on Instagram, Switch TV Kenya on Facebook. Right now, we're getting into a very interesting conversation. COVID came and it hit everything. Everybody left, right, center. And one of the sectors that was really affected is real estate. Now, how if we told you that there's an option for you to actually get affordable housing? And, um, you know, having this conversation with us this morning is Esther. Wagura. <laughs> Karibu sana. <laughs> Pleasure to be here. Uh, and we're glad that you're here. You're bringing solutions. Kindly yes. uh, tell us what company you work for and uh, what it does really. All right. I'm Esther Wagura. Yes. CEO of Resedi Homes. Mm -hmm. uh, we are developers. Mm -hmm. Our work is to help Kenyans and diaspora because they are really our main target and a good market for us to own homes and affordable homes. Yes. Okay. Yes. And when you say affordable homes, uh, like I said earlier, when COVID came, yes. what to Aliko Michkwa mortgage, loans, exactly. left, right, center, and yeah. then things happened. True. You lost your stream of income. Exactly. Or probably you got a pay cut, lost your job, and you're not able to pay the mortgages sure. and the loans and everything. So that really affected the industry as a well. A lot, a lot. How, how are you able to, as a, as a company, to, you know, withstand that last year and be able to come up with a solution for even Kenyans who got really affected. Exactly. Uh, thank you so much, Mikari. Indeed, it is true. Yeah. Uh, the industry, the real estate industry was really affected by COVID, which affected people globally. Mm -hmm. And it really hit everybody. Uh, and one thing I, I always say, challenges come to make us strong That's and true. to make us strategize even more. Very true. And as much as you are... Uh, affected mm -hmm. we really had a time to sit down and reason together and come up with a plan how do we help our people those who had already had homes with us and those kenyans through the covid because one thing that covid has taught people is uh, a home is a necessity it is it is a basic need yes. that is something that covid has taught us it is a basic need and what we did uh even before the covid came mm -hmm. uh through our clientele and our database uh we had seen the need of having affordable homes because there is that uh group of people especially uh what do we call them we call them uh the median household income mm -hmm. that earns maybe below 50,000 yes. because that is a, a target of having affordable homes. Mm -hmm. And those people, I can tell you, we carry, they are 74%. Wow. There are so many. There are so many. Those people that earn below yeah. 50,000, mm -hmm. they have a need to own homes. Yeah. And it was a market that has been forgotten for quite some time. Mm -hmm. And we came up with a strategy. How can we help these people, especially during this COVID season, mm -hmm. for them to own home? Because especially this COVID season, when you're infected with COVID season, you are quarantining yourself at home. Yes. I was a victim. You Call can imagine. <laughs> yeah, but I'm okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now you can imagine being in a rental. Maybe it is one bedroom. You mm. have a family. You mm -hmm. are quarantining yourself. Mm. It is really a hassle. Yes. And that one was awakening call to our people that we need to own homes. And that is why we came with the, uh, affordable homes. And indeed, I think we are the only developer that has that product. Ah. Because our homes, they range from, in fact, the first project that we sold out around uh, April, mm -hmm. it was going for 1.95 million, oh, which wow. is already sold out. Okay. And you know, with such uh, product, that one is affordable to any, any Kenyan who is a medium, you know, mm. a middle, whatever, earning between 50,000 and below. Mm -hmm. What our people lack is information and the right people to help you uh, understand how can I own home with what I get. Yes. And uh, after strategizing and we came up with those products, I can tell you they are so much overwhelming. We have sold that product of, let's say, 2 million. It is sold out. We are doing, a, we have already sold another one at Kabati, which, is, which was going for um, 2.75. 2 
between 2.5 million to 2.75 yes. it is already sold out mm -hmm. what you need what our people need to know is how can i be able to own a home yes. one thing we did uh -huh. we came up with a, a product that is affordable to kenyans okay. and we came up with that you know sometimes what really affect our people from owning homes is when you have a product mm -hmm. that maybe you're asking for a two million deposit yes if today i tell you mikali give me a two million uh deposit mm. and you have a balance to pay mm. i can tell you you will feel that pinch mm -hmm. but we came with a product that is so much affordable and we were asking for a very 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 minimal deposit and i can tell you with the people that deposit? we are targeting five hundred thousand and oh. i can tell you these people that we are targeting mm -hmm. five hundred thousand as deposit is mm -hmm. amount that maybe if you are in a circle Yes, you, you are able, able to just to go get it. Yes. If you are in a bank, that is amount that you know you want to struggle a lot for you to have mm -hmm. the five hundred thousand as a deposit. Then the balance, uh, and you know there is one thing we always say. Maybe yes. before I go there, okay. Affordable okay. means a lot, not just affordable, mm -hmm. but in our company as Resendi Homes, mm -hmm. affordability comes in in the payment plan that we have for our clients. Okay. Because we have a very affordable payment plan okay. that will help this client be able to pay pay that deposit and within a time frame of between 12 to 18 months this client to 18 months. Yes, this client will be able to accomplish that so i think we have a product for those people and i can tell you it is so much overwhelming mm -hmm. and the need of a house is now a mandatory that's true yes we learned the hard way exactly we did exactly. and when you talk about affordable housing we've yes. looked at one aspect which is the pricing and yes. the affordability of the payment plan as well there's yes. no pressure to be like saizi immediately exactly. i'll give you six months yeah. so that you own yeah. a home yeah. and um how how big is this house now in fact we i in fact i hate uh, or i don't like using that word house because mm -hmm. if you it's google, a home <laughs> if you google a house and a home it is totally different <laughs> yes so we are coming out from a house to, <laughs> to a, a home. home so okay so i That's love true. using that word we the are home. giving people homes yes and they are not just houses they are big homes because uh, the homes that we do, we do from two bedrooms and above. Ah, okay. Seated on a very large uh, piece of land, 40 mm -hmm. by 80. Okay. It is a, a house, a home we build with a very precious maybe sitting room. Mm -hmm. And all the interiors, you know, all the, all, all the features of the house, really, it is a home. And with the price that we give, and with the piece of land that we give you, mm -hmm. 40 by 80, mm -hmm. and with the price of the whole house, mm -hmm. I can tell you we are really concerned and we really mind about our Kenyans and to make sure everybody own homes. So our homes, there are two bedrooms. We have, okay. we have a project of two bedroom houses okay. uh, seated on 40 by 80. Mm -hmm. The parking area can even accommodate between one to two, three cars, depending on the size of the car. Ah, so it is okay. a home. It has a compound that your kids will uh, use to pray. Mm -hmm. uh, and in every project that we do, we always leave uh, a space called greenhouse. Uh, green area, sorry, not greenhouse. Oh, green okay. area, sorry. Green area. Uh, this is a space that we leave in our project to make sure the community that is living in that, uh, in that uh, project, they have enough space. Because maybe your space, where the houses might not be bigger enough. Mm -hmm. The kids want to pray. Yes. You have visitors, maybe you have chamas who are visiting mm. you. So we make sure you are comfortable. Okay. Yes. And where are these projects located? All oh, right. Because people will be like, okay, your price is Nitaishi, Uku, Karibu town. Imagine, you can pay your rent when you're in Yeah. <laughs> so our projects are located around Thika Road, or mm -hmm. our projects are around Thika Road, but we are growing. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a project, but that one is sold out. We had our one project that that we sold at Wetavia. Ah, uh, that is close, just before Thika. Exactly. Mm. Opposite Mango High School. Yes. Yeah. That one is sold out. It was going for 1.95 million. Mm -hmm. uh, we are now in, uh, at Kabati, mm -hmm. just at Kabati town ah. or Kabati center. In fact, it Where is, is 200 meters on your way after Brew Post. Do you know Brew Post? Oh, yes, I do. After Brew Post on your way to Nyeri. In fact, it is 10 minutes drive from Thika ah. uh, at Kabati center. Okay. 200 meters from Kabati center. Uh, next to the road. In fact, the area is fully developed. Okay. All the infrastructure, all the amenity, their school. Mm -hmm. So you're not coming, uh, the community you're building there, it is not the community that will form the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. It is already mm -hmm. a developed area. Yes. And we are doing, we have done three bedroom houses. 
uh, though I only have, I think, two units remaining. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing but those ones, they well. are a bit high. They are going for 4.75, which is still uh, yeah. very affordable. Mm -hmm. 4.75 million when you pay cash and mm. 4.95 million when you pay installment. Okay. Uh, but we have really done a lot of two-bedroom houses. The first phase is already gone. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> which we started around the pre it is already sold out. Mm -hmm. uh, we were doing the same two-bedroom houses. They were going for two... Uh, they were going for 2.5 million cash and mm -hmm. 2.75 million installment. Right now we're in the second phase, which is almost sold out okay. in the same place. So would you say the ones, because the idea was to create homes yes. for uh, middle incomers exactly. and the young ones as well, sure. because Utapata, uh, maybe our fathers and uh, well, uh, <laughs> they, they are earning more exactly. than it's, if it's your first entry job yes. and you're looking to True. own a home. True. Would you say that we are getting into that space of owning homes are those your major clients having created this project for them are they are they are they getting into it are they paying are they owning homes now i'm about to yeah. legia, legia. Uh, no, no. <laughs> we cannot complain i cannot complain from yes. where i sit as a yes. ceo of residi homes yes in fact god has given me very good 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 clients mm -hmm. and what we do uh we are doing you know there is a word that uh, people doesn't or don't like using off plan because you know how the market and the industry has been you know that off plan thing has been used to manipulate a lot yes. of kenyans and yeah. people that n are in need of owning homes mm -hmm. so what we do we do uh middle uh mid plan houses okay. what i mean is this uh we get lands where we build these houses and one of the things we do for us to gain confidence with our clients, and I think that is why God has elevated us, after now uh, uh, procuring this land, mm -hmm. we use our own money as a residue to start off this project. Uh, okay. So okay. when we are marketing this project outside there as mm -hmm. mid plan, mm -hmm. When client is coming on board, already we as Residi Home, we mm -hmm. have already invested our money in yes. that. So when a client comes, at least he has confidence with us. Mm. So what we do, there are those who will pay cash. Uh, the projects are ongoing. Yes. They take between 12 to uh, 12 months mm -hmm. upon completion. Mm -hmm. Though there are some that I know we will deliver before the 12 months are over. Mm -hmm. So what we do, you pay your deposit. Mm -hmm. Then, because we have now the payment plan of maybe 12 months or 14 months, depending on yeah. a client. Mm -hmm. So you pay monthly installment as we do these houses. Okay. So by the end of these 12 months, we are ready to do hand over your houses together with the title deed and everything that comes with that house. Uh -huh. So we build together with our clients. And you know, that one has really helped us as a company because we have really not gone the way of uh, requesting or going or borrowing loans from the banks, which is a very good thing and healthy for an institution. Okay. Yes. Okay. And for uh, people who are looking to get pieces of land yes. and then probably okay. develop them their own way or help them in the vision mm -hmm. that they have. So maybe they've come up with their own plan, with their own architecture, um, and now you are providing the piece of land yes. and overseeing the project as it goes up. Is that something that is possible with Leseri? Uh, no, 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 no. We mm -hmm. really, that is, uh, you know, I have received a lot of uh, concerns from the clients <laughs> yes. going that direction. Uh -huh. But now as developers, if yes. we go that direction, we lose our focus. Okay. Because our aim is to have homes that we will give to our people. Uh, so when you come, we carry that you have a piece of land you want me to develop. It mm -hmm. will be like now I'm changing the policy mm -hmm. and the way of doing things as Resedi. Okay. But it is a need that is there. It is something I know we, me and with my board. Uh, in future, it is something that we'll sit down and look at. But currently, mm -hmm. we are developing our own house in our own land that we are selling back ah, to the society. Okay. Yes. Okay. So yeah. I'll come into just our homes. Uh, the hassle in and fact, bustle. We, exactly. You don't have that hassle to build. No. You pay us, you leave us with your money, we do your house. What you can be doing is you can be checking your progress. It mm -hmm. is your house. The yes. moment you pay that deposit, you don't mm -hmm. even call me to tell me, yes, I'm going to the site. Yeah. That is your house. Keep, in fact, there is one thing that my director keep telling our clients. Can you give us pressure to make <laughs> sure we deliver? So when a client goes to the, to, to the site to check the progress, maybe yes. you paid your installment last month, you need to know. 
-hmm. I paid this much last month. Mm -hmm. Where did my money go? Mm. So we build together with our clients something that is really good. Okay. Yeah. What happens to the piece of land that this house is on? Uh, As in? So I'm, I'm buying a house. Yes. From Lesedi. Yes. And I have bought it cash. Besha, fari fari. So the piece of land that uh, the house stands on, yes. that still belongs to Lesedi. Now, or do we? What, what happens? we do? Release I it? think we have, you know, we have removed a lot of asset work. We are selling you a house price, a land. The price I'm quoting is inclusive of the piece. So of I'll land. get my title. You will only get your title. Yes. That is beautiful because Very most of the beautiful. houses you you find on Ambiwa, you need to just lease it for no. ninety nine years, then, and then you'll renew it again, no, paying no, some no, amount no, of money no, to no, the no, government. No, no. We sell we we sell you the home plus the plot plus mm -hmm. everything. Okay. That uh, price is inclusive. Absolutely. Of the of the piece of, of land. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Yes. Kwawale watu wenye tukuokuinge and we want to get houses. <laughs> How do we get in touch with it you? It is very possible. I can tell you, we can yes. like five years back. Mm -hmm. I would hear of people talking of owning home that was like, no, homes, nisa matajiri. Nisa matajiri. Until I, uh, I now had the information. And yes. I want to talk to the youth that is outside yes. there, who is earning 100,000. Mm -hmm. But maybe you are living in a rental houses of 40,000, 50,000. Mm -hmm. It is very possible. Get the right people. S sit down with the right people. Get information. Have people that will walk you through to mm -hmm. make sure you own those homes. And we are here as resident homes. Yeah. Come, we sit down with you. I'll be able to to educate you on how you can be spending maybe like uh, forty percent of your salary. The sixty percent you be saving it or you be uh, investing yeah. it in homes. And it where is are very your possible. offices? Our offices are located at Parklands. Okay. Uh, West Park Suit, mm -hmm. second floor. Okay. That is where we are. Social media numbers to pig. Yes, yes, yes. I will give out our number. Okay. Uh, our numbers to call. Uh, yes. There's 0728 mm -hmm. 344 Just say that again. 0728 uh, 344 And I'll give out another because there really traffic is a lot. Uh -huh. uh, 0700 mm -hmm. 444422. Okay. Yes. Asante sana kwa kuja. Thank you so much. And I hope you all have learned and are going yes. to get yourself homes, not houses. In fact, <laughs> we, are, we will be waiting for you. <laughs> Absolutely. Exactly. And I've got some winners here. Remember the question was, how many books have you read so far? Hi, Mikali and Purity. I've read five books. They inspire me so much. Uh, Who Moved My Cheese, Blossoms of the Savannah, A Dollhouse, Beyond Limit, The River and the Sauce. Your number ends at 096. I love reading. I have read nine books from October last year. Seven highly Habits of Effective People by uh, Stephen Covey, Stealth Matters, Dr. Phil, How to Think and Grow Rich, Design Your Own Life, 21 Success Secrets uh, of Self-Made Millionaire by Brian Tracy. Your number is at 014. Uh, I say I've read six books. Think, Grow Rich, Rich Poor, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, Richest Man in Babylon. Uh, your number ends at 263. You've listed more. I have just haven't read them through. Morning, Mikali. I read I read a lot, but my fave books are 48 Laws, This Is Us, The Last Unicorn, Becoming Becoming uh, by Michelle Obama. Your number ends at 348. Hi, Mikali. I have read The Purpose Driven Life by Rick Warren, The 5 a.m. Club by Robin Sharma, The Obstacle is the Way by Ryan Holiday, Cash Flow Quadrant by Robert T. Kiyosaki. And the list goes on. Your number ends at 776. So keep sending those in for you to walk away with the gift hamper courtesy of Hako Industries. We'll be right back after this break. <laughs>